today I'm going to show you how I make my crispy spicy wings with this sweet and spicy dipping sauce. So for these sweet and spicy chicken wings I got four full wings and I do keep the wing tips uh, just seasoned with a little cayenne pepper and cracked black pepper and these will go on a pan. I'll just place them out on a cookie sheet. Uh, this cookie sheet is an old, well-seasoned tin pan. There's no non-stick on it. You don't need non-stick pans. Actually, they're quite toxic. I'm just going to position these out. And then they'll go in the oven on 400. I'll let you know how long it takes. While the wings are in the oven for the delicious sweet and spicy dipping sauce you want to add about one tablespoon of oil. I used olive oil. You can use any oil. Coconut oil is fine as well to your pan and get it warm. You want to toss in one large clove of chopped fresh garlic and just stir that around just until the garlic turns a little golden. And you can turn the heat down and add in about three tablespoons of ketchup and it will flatter to stand up. And then a good hot sauce. And this is completely to your taste. I'm going to use what's left in the bottle here, which is about a tablespoon. I'm going to wipe up that splatter here. And about a teaspoon of honey. So this is like honey, garlic, sweet and spicy, delicious dipping sauce. So what I made here is enough for two, which is those four wings cut into pieces. So while the wings are in the oven, I'm also going to get some potato wedges in the oven. If you want to keep this paleo, you want to use some sweet potato. So I'm just going to cut these into wedges and pop them on another cookie sheet with some olive oil and a little cracked pepper and place them in alongside the wings. So the potato wedges are oiled and got some cracked black pepper. Feel free to put any kind of herbs on it you like. Uh, any spice blend or rosemary or anything like that. It'll be great. So into the oven. They'll go. And to make sure we're consuming enough raw foods, just chopped up some vegetables. It's pretty simple. Some carrots and celery and some broccoli and cauliflower. And I'm going to make a really quick and easy yogurt dip. So for the yogurt dip, I'm going to use a full fat organic yogurt. You can also use sour cream if you like. And just a couple of tablespoons. And all I'm going to add to it is some minced onion. Just about a teaspoon. And about a teaspoon of onion powder. And if you don't like these flavors, you can pretty much add any flavors you like to the yogurt or just leave it plain. And this Tastes like a sour cream and onion dip. And it was as simple as that. And we'll place that on the side for the dip for the veggies. So here you have it. A nice plate of munchies for supper. We have some potato wedges just done in the oven with olive oil and pepper. We have some baked crispy chicken wings with this sweet and spicy dipping sauce. Look how good that looks. And then we also have a nice variety of raw veggies and a yogurt dip. So I hope you enjoy.